What's up, everybody? Greg here, and I'm at work. <laughs> I'm at work. I'm working today. But I have other things in plan for today as well. So I'm going to try to kill a couple of birds with one stone. Um, and yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll just see what happens. I'm going to do a little, uh, Miss Dove Figs, what's up? I'm going to do a little pop out chat here. And that way, Luke, what's up? That way I can sort of keep an eye on work. Recovering Toy Attic. I'm going to move this camera a little bit. Get it over here so I can sort of, you know, kill two birds with one stone. David Becker, what's up, my friend? What's up? Oh, that's right. That's right. I'm actually uh, going to be working uh, today. I got a photo shoot this morning. Uh, it's actually real close to work. And then I'll be working the rest of the day. So I figured I'd come in and we'd do a uh, live Funko shop thing this morning because i uh, got about 33 minutes until the uh, Funko shop goes live. <sighs> I totally missed out on the fun days thing. I'll be honest with you, this is my first uh, SDC. C and uh, I didn't know anything about that, the box of fun, so I was a newbie mistake. What's up, Sam? Shane, Matthews, Nerdy Nation, what's up? TMSM meme guy, how you doing? Alex Lopez is in the house. Uh, I don't know what's gonna drop today. Um, I'm hoping, uh, yes, that Pennywise Freddy looks good. Uh, I did order the uh, Deadpool collector core box this morning because I got, somebody texted me this morning, oh man, it's on my phone, but it looks like Deadpool's on a unicorn as a hint. And I think I saw Dis Funko post the same thing on Instagram, so I think that'd be pretty cool. The Pepe Le Pew, I did not get that. Uh, Here's, here's the thing. So basically, I did not get anything from Barnes & Noble because everything Barnes & Noble had was in the store only and I had to work. Emma, what's up? Christopher, what's up? Uh, you know, sometimes you, uh, you miss out on what you're wanting, but hey, what's up, Jeremy? Pop Attic, what's up? So yeah, I didn't get, and only, let's see, what I wanted, the the Craglin, I thought that'd be pretty cool. Uh, the, the, the Pepe Le Pew, I was looking for that one, and possibly the Ant-Man Classic, but you know, hey, you win some, you lose some, but that's okay. But as of right now, I am, I've been keeping a running tally on what I've picked up so far. What's up, Sonny? Um, so for, for my first 20, my first SDCC official one, I think I've done pretty good so far. I'm up to, uh, I think 20 pops right now, as of right now today. I did score the Chrome three pack on the pop-up shop yesterday. And I also scored the Entertainment Earth Playboy Penguin and Hellboy in the suit. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy so far. But everybody knows what I want. I want that nuts ride. I'm sweating it. I'm sweating it. I don't know when it's gonna drop. Uh, and uh, oh my goodness, only five thousand of them. Oh, sweet. Uh, but yeah, that's, uh, um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. And uh, if I get it, I get it. I hope everybody's actually been able to get a lot of stuff that they've been looking for. Um, you know, when, let's see, because I was on 
Jetta's mega stream Sunday night, I know Wednesday night, and that actually carried over, and everybody started, you know, I know a few people took the day off. I had to work uh, that day, release day, so I couldn't do anything. So I wound up just staying up. Me and Cletus uh, Selden, we wound up chatting um, through uh, Google Hangouts till about 2.38 Thursday morning. And uh, man, when three o'clock hit, or Eastern time, when uh, Hot Topic and uh, Box Lunch and all them, man, it was on. Foxy for reels in the house. Good morning, my friend. We're just waiting on the pop-up shop to go uh, to go live here in about 28 minutes. Uh, so you guys will be able to see me live, whether or not I have a meltdown, or if I'm freaking doing backflips, or if I cry sadly. <laughs> uh, yeah, the Clone Wars. I'm excited for that as well. Uh, but, so, I did pick up some stuff. I went by, um, I don't know what's on the shop today. I honestly don't. I know there's, what, two more days? So, uh, they had the three-pack yesterday, and uh, that other two, I can't remember what it was. So, the Nux rides, either, nothing else. Uh, yes, pain and panic. So, uh, but I did, I go, because I've got the other two, um, the Hank PYM and all oh, the one without, I think it's Hank without his mask. So I, I saw this one, Barnes Noble picked that up. And I already had one of these. A buddy of mine picked it up from the live stream last Sunday, Josh. Uh, but he's working today, and I actually wanted to get another one of these. But I'm now the proud owner of a clone Commander Wolf. And this thing is wicked cool looking. It is. I do have at least two things for the day. Uh, but I got a photo shoot uh, about right after 10:30. Uh, I told I told uh, Lauren who I'm doing the shoot with. She actually works here as well, and uh, that's G Man. I've got the Ant Man set too, and I'm waiting on it as well from Sumi. Uh, I'm it's and I'm 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 pulling my teeth over it because I'm just ah, wanting it. So I told her uh, yesterday, I said, I tell you what, we were scheduled to go for 10 this morning. I said, let's make it uh, after 1030, you show up because the pop-up shop, can't miss it. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Jeremy. Yeah, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna open one of mine, Foxy. I, I'm, I just think this thing is so freaking cool. And the fact that he's got soft goods that that's even better. So yeah, I'm 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 digging it. I'm digging this. What's up, Mary Lou? Uh, the Barnes and Noble three for twenty. Uh, I did not see anything in the store that said three for twenty. But to be honest with you, they didn't have a whole lot of pops in the. I mean, they had pops, but they they actually were a little light. And everything they had stuff they've always always had. So. I wasn't sweating it. I wasn't sweating it. 20, this is gonna be the longest 25 minutes ever. And I and that's why I went live. I was like, you know what? I can't just sit here. I gotta do something. Uh, that's a good question. I know this is what, cause when you, do, when you hit the click me, it goes straight to it. Um, but I will say this, I have not, I've, that's a lie. I've got one thing that's SDCC related in my hand, and that's my Red Hood from GameStop. Um, everything else I have ordered online because 
when you got to work, you got to work. Um, all right, Alex, thanks for dropping by. Uh, so, yeah, and I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. It makes for a long night, I will tell you that. Uh, now I understand what everybody was talking about for SDCC. You either take the day off uh, or you just plan on staying up all night. So I stayed up all night. Yeah, the Moaning Myrtle. Yeah, I got that one. I've got, let's see, what what is my list here? Let me pull my list out and I'll just name off everything I've got so far. All right, so I got the Red Hood, the Iron Man, Moaning Myrtle, Cad Bane, Valkyrie, the Running Flags, Stinkor, Skeeter Valentine, Captain Caveman, Soldier 76, uh, the Flash Chrome 3 Pack, Playboy Penguin, Hellboy, and I also got some non SDCC. I got, I got the Witch Black Phillip and the Beetlejuice God. That's that's what I have officially picked up as of now for the last couple of days. <laughs> oh, let me tell you something. When I, when, all right, so here's the thing. Um, I did not... Uh, I'd seen the picture of the ride. Let me get rid of this little pop up right here that's driving me crazy and when i was when cletus was on the mega stream and he he actually pulled it out the box itself is epically cool but when he popped it out of the box and started talking about it wow that was crazy so i mean according to according to what cletus was saying it actually has rubber tires they don't turn but they're actual rubber tires so I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to that. So yeah, we'll see. Like I said, dude, yeah. I did not get a box of fun because to be honest with you, I didn't even know nothing about a box of fun. I completely did not know. Didn't have a clue. Didn't know. So, that's part of it. What the heck is this? I'm getting, uh, getting messages here. I don't even know, honestly, I don't even know what the box of fun is. I don't even know what's in it. So if you guys can educate me, I'm all for education. Uh, oh, that's cool. Turtle Temple. That's cool. But like I said earlier, I did uh, order the, uh, I did that this morning, the Amazon collector box. I ordered it this morning because supposedly i mean it's deadpool related which is cool and this one i think like i said i think it was dis funko posted this morning but i got a text message with this morning it looks like it's it might be a deadpool on a unicorn which i think that'd be really cool <laughs> let me tell you something after when the wind counting wednesday thursday and by the time i went to bed thursday afternoon i had been up 41 straight hours work mega stream sdcc shopping work 41 straight hours that's right rocking and rolling if you're going to be dumb you got to be tough <laughs> At least that's the way I'm, I see it. <laughs> that's, that's right. Struggles are real. Man, I got 26 people in here. That's awesome. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. 
I truly do. I just, I just think it'd be funny, you know, because uh, when I done that, that video uh, about when I got the three pack, that was pretty cool, and uh, <laughs> I just thought I was thinking this morning. I thought, you know what? Let's 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 do this shopping on on, on live this morning. Uh, and that way, if everybody else is shopping, that's cool because you can put in the chat if you get whatever it is. So I did get a tip yesterday. Um, evidently, I've been wasting time doing the estimated shipping and putting your state and zip code in there. God told me, man, don't do that. You don't need to do that. I was like, oh. Crunchberry Beast, you know, I want that too. So... What, here's the thing, if it's the pop ride, if it's the nux ride and cranberry beast, I'm going for the punch ride, the, the, the uh, nux ride. That's what I'm going for. Because I'm telling you right now, there was a guy that actually works here. He was trying to get the uh, three-pack flash yesterday, but he made the same mistake that I've made in the past with the, the Funko shop. He tried to be greedy and, and Get, get everything, and Cletus said it on the mega stream the other night. He said, look, as soon as you see what you want, grab it, check out. If you try to go back, and I agree with this because it's bit me before, if you try to go back and try to add everything, you're going to lose everything. So pick it, run with it. That, that's all we can do. Then... Uh, my buddy Kent, he posted in our little uh, Facebook group this morning that uh, he found some of the uh, Dorby, Dor Dobbies in, in the Targets in his area up in North Carolina. So I checked my Target. Nope. Nope. And I saw that when I was in Atlanta. I saw it uh, and one of the, the vendors had it. And God, that thing is huge. Huge. The box is like this. It's like two 10-inch boxes put together. I mean, the, the pop itself is really no bigger but than a normal 10-inch, but wow. 10, what do you mean what was with the hotel during? Oh, for me, I was actually on a work trip. <laughs> I was actually on a work trip. So I actually, uh, I guess it was about 4.30 or 5 in the morning, uh, that Thursday morning, that I had to drive two hours back to my office here. Um, that's it. I also saw, too, uh, let me pull it up, because I saw that there was some really, um, I almost reached my phone to do it, but. <coughs> let me look here. Let me look here. So. There's some look. There's some new pops that evidently are going to be released too, because this Funko posted them later on this year. Die Hard pops. The Die Hard pops would be cool to get. Even though I think one of them looks like John Wick. Um, Die Hard. Let's see, Trading Places. Which, if that pop looks like it does in the picture, it looks like Eddie Murphy. Austin Powers. Um, I think the Brady Bunch. So yeah, looks like we got some pretty, uh, pretty good pops coming out later on in the year, which is cool. All right, we getting close. Fourteen minutes and counting. Fourteen minutes. We had a we had a, a luau party at work, so I can put my luau on if you guys think I need to keep it on. Kona Brewing Company, yeah, that's right, Anthony. Yeah, baby. Let's see here, what else is going on? Oh, Kent was also post, post he's post picture of the gargoyle pops. Brooklyn, Bimana, Broadway, Bronx. Ken's out hunting right now, man. He's he's a hunt, he's a hunting machine. 
<laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true, Jetta. If it's not today, it's definitely tomorrow. Um, the drawback to me personally, I think it's, I think it's harder to grit. I think it's harder to get something on a Saturday or on a weekend than it is during a work day, during a work week. So I think, uh, yeah, Kent's got a YouTube channel. Uh, hang on a minute, I'll uh, I'll post it in the in the link uh, in the chat. Let's right, see, uh, here he is. Bam. There you go. Da, 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 da. I'm trying to balance work emails. We had some really bad storms here last night. Uh, so our Atlanta office and Alpharetta office, the Alpharetta, our Alpharetta office had to do some uh, generator power last night. Here I am talking about work. God, see, I can't even get it. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see. 12 minutes. 12 minutes, and it's on like Donkey Kong. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What do I have? What, what is this? Get rid of that. Yeah. I mean... Oh, I will tell you this. Uh, I found this out yesterday, too, and this scared the crap at me. If you refresh the, the Funko Shops website like too many times, it will put you in timeout. Literally, you cannot, you can't go to your, on your computer, Chrome, Internet Explorer, even your phone. It will time you out. And that scared the freaking bejesus out of me yesterday. Because I thought it was like five minutes before uh, it, it went live. And I was in timeout. Oh, that's great, Matthew. Everybody check out Matthew's channel, man. He's got some good stuff. What's up, Max Wilcott? Going good, man. Going good. Yeah, but I'm telling you right now, man, that literally just... I about stroked out. Seriously. Yeah. That's true, Matthew. Do it. Emma, man, Emma and her dad, man, they're... they'll, they'll, they'll Man, they're awesome. Oh, come on. Got my... Got, got my got my card right here. I'm ready. <laughs> Ten more minutes. Ten more minutes. Oh man, Matthew, you getting there, man? Let me tell you something. Uh, hashtag no small creator. We all have something to uh, bring to the table. Trust me, ever just man. There's there's too much. You're right, Tim. That dude. When like I said, when Cletus pulled it out of the box and he was actually putting it up close to the camera and stuff. I actually, it's on my phone, but I actually took a screenshot of him holding it. Oh, epic, epic. Funko Pop hunts with Storm. How are you today? I don't even know what the price for the nuts is going to be. I wonder what. I wonder what. Wonder what. What do you? What's everybody think it's going to go for? Because the two pack, the three pack flash, I think was what twenty five. I think. Red Hood, Dustin, Ant Man, that's so ten inch screws. Yes, nice. Forty bucks. Okay. Something like thirty nine ninety five or forty nine ninety five. I don't care. Has anybody bought any of that cereal yet? <laughs> okay, forty bucks. 
I, seriously, the box itself, and even Cletus said this, that he didn't even know if he was even going to even remotely take it out of the box because the box looks that cool. Um, I think, honestly, um, the Nux ride, based on what I have actually seen through the Mega Stream and pictures, I personally think it's going to be the best pop of 2018. Uh, and I think a big chunk of that is because, in my, and this is just my opinion, number one, the box itself is nothing like it. The ride itself, it's completely, you know, it's almost like the Wally Pop. It's just different. But, yeah. I'm just curious about the cereal. I mean, I, I don't know. I'm just, I just wonder if it's, uh, if it's crap or if it's actually decent. And if you, let me ask this, if you actually bought it, that, <laughs> That's a, that's good, Tim. That's good. <laughs> What's crazy is um, the three-pack flash actually is coming to my wife because I had her email in there from way back, and it kept it. She'll probably hold it hostage. The last time I got something from the Funko pop-up shop that had her name on it, yeah, she opened it up before I even got home. Yeah. I, w I would love to see the statistics on how many people right now are actually refreshing the page right now. And I'd also like to see, I'm Interpop, I'm waiting for the Funko shop. Everybody else is, I don't know, I don't know how many people in the chat are, are waiting, but I'm waiting. But I hope everybody is if you are waiting, I hope you get I hope you get whatever it is. Parts of me is thinking that the nuts ride will be tomorrow. Parts of me. Because to me, I'd want to go out on a big note. Um, and let's see for in that link that I posted, okay, so. I mean, the three pack, the banana splits. I think. Oh man, yeah. I mean, there's not there's not a whole lot left. Five more minutes. Oh yeah, Emma. The phone's running. I'm at work. I'm yeah cards in hand <laughs> I mean let me look here look here see right there I mean it's <laughs> you guys are going to be you're going to see me either flip my lid because I was successful or flip my lid because I failed one of the two <laughs> one of the two Exactly, him. It's on like Donkey Kong. Four minutes. Oh my goodness. The Crunchberry Beast looks good, and if it pops up, I'm gonna try to get it. As long as the nuts ride's not with it. Crunchberry Beast can go take a hike if it's paired up with the nuts ride. But there's only think about it. Yesterday's Funko Shop. It's so everything sold out. I think in less than five minutes. And I don't think there was a limit on, I mean, I don't think there was a numbered count on the Flash three packs. There's only 5,000 of the rides. There's only 5,000. Three minutes. Three minutes. According to my work computer, my phone says three minutes too, so I'm in sync here. I'm in sync. So everybody that's actually on the chat now, we got 19 people. Give me a thumbs up if you're waiting on the, the, the shop as well. If you're like me and you're just waiting to actually buy something today on the pop-up shop. Whew. 
This is, this is, man. I've done a lot of things in my life. And uh, Kent's in the house. What's up, Kent? Uh, I've done a lot of things in my life that's got me, uh, you know, on edge. I would have never dreamed that a piece of plastic that's made in Vietnam that costs about four cents to make would actually get me this hyped up. Would have never dreamed it. Two minutes. Two minutes. Whew. All right. It's getting ready to get quiet. I'm sorry, but when that when we when we get down to that last sixty seconds, buddy, it's about. <laughs> I'm zoning out, guys. I'm zoning out. And the crazy thing about it is, is you don't know. It's like you want to hit refresh because you don't know. But then you don't want to hit it too many times because they put you in timeout. One minute. All right, guys. 60 seconds. 60 seconds. Come on. This this building can catch on fire right now, and I honestly do not think I would move. Come on, come on, come on. The anticipation. The anticipation. <clears throat> If you hear any bumps and, and bangs, there's a uh, our company has a weight room right above me, and there's some guys up there working out today. Oh, wait a minute. There's the uh, Crunchberry Beast. I might as well grab him. See if I can get him. Because he's cool. I'm in line. I'm in line. Crunchberry and Dorbs. Crunchberry Beast is pretty cool, though. I'm not going to lie. Due to their high traffic, you need to wait a few minutes. When it's your turn, checkout will load automatically. <laughs> This Funko just posted a, po a photo. I'm telling you right now, this Funko, I do not know what this guy does. I don't know nothing about this guy, but he is a beast. He's a beast. But I, I'm waiting in line for the Crunchberry Beast. We're going to see. And I'm okay with that. So now that means the... The Nux ride, they're gonna go out with a with a bang. And the Nux ride will be tomorrow. And my phone's blowing up messenger right now. People say, oh, Nux ride is tomorrow, Nux ride is tomorrow, Nux ride is tomorrow, Nux ride is tomorrow. Congrats, Jacob. Good deal. That's awesome. You know, honestly, Cold Fan 03, I, I would. I would I would have either done the Nux Ride first or last. But since the Nux Ride is so different, um, I would go last with it. Congratulations, Chelsea. Good deal. So maybe I'll luck out and everybody will get drunk tonight. Saturday night and they'll have hangovers tomorrow and I'll be the only one in line. I'll be the only one on the pop-up shop. <laughs> Man, this is taking a while on this line. I don't know. 
things aren't looking good. Uh-oh, sold out. I missed it. Right there. Whoops. Boom. Oh, well. I did not get a Crunchberry Beast, but that's okay. That's okay. That was quick. 10.33. 10.33. Two minutes. Crunchberry Beast sold out. I was in line too, Jetta Chisel, and it just popped up and said that uh, my cart was empty, sold out. But think about it. The Crunch Berry Beast, two minutes. Not a numbered quantity, two minutes. The Nuts Ride, I honestly, I do not, Emma. <laughs> Wait a minute. Emma, is that you or your dad? <laughs> no, Emma, I did not get it. Uh, I was in line, then it popped up that it had sold out. <laughs> I just want to... I just want to know, Emma, that was, that was good. <laughs> that was, it was like, damn it, I missed it. <laughs> oh, no, no, Emma, I did, I did, I did not get the uh, crunch berry beast. <laughs> oh, I did, Matthew, I did not expect that either. I did not expect that either. Now, what I'm curious about, so I'm going back to the shop. Still says shop now. Crunchberry B sold out. The four pack of the Dorbs still there for Captain Crunch. The Yummy Mummy and Fruit Bright, they're still available. And Quick Draw McGraw and uh, Baba Louie. So, hey, if you need Dorbs, they're still, they're still there. Uh, but Crunchberry Beast is sold out. Ooh, the, the box looked really cool. That's awesome. Everybody that got the Crunchberry Beast, man, congrats to you. That's awesome. Um, here's the problem. See, I hesitated. When it first popped up and I saw the, the three things, the four things that were offered, I hesitated probably 10 seconds before I clicked on the Crunchberry Beast. 10 seconds because I was looking at the other things. Boom. That's how quick. The vinyls do look good, to be honest with you. The uh, Yummy Mummy and the, and the Fruit the fruit Brute, that looks pretty cool. The Quick Draw McGraw, actually out of all of them, the Quick Draw McGraw and Baba Louie look really cool. They look really cool. I'm, I'm just, you know, it's Hanna-Barbera. I mean, you know, you can't, you can't really go wrong with uh, Hanna-Barbera. Now, the, the Dorbs, no. Vinyls, there's some vinyls that are actually pretty cool. Just contact Kalitas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you, man. I don't know if you, how many of you guys are watching that mega screen, screen, mega stream that uh, Jetta did with had us all on it. <clears throat> and when I was talking to Cletus later on in the night, I told him I said the one thing that honestly, he he, he had you know all these pops, which is great. <clears throat> But um, if you follow him on Instagram, you'll see what I'm talking about. The, uh, those big Funko bags, those big blue Funko bags, <coughs> those actually thrilled me in a way more than the Pops did. I mean, that's, that's crazy. Oh my God, yeah. Yes, that was a, when, when we actually were still live and still trying to, uh, uh, get stuff and <clears throat> it turned into a competition to see uh, 
between Cletus, me, and Top Pops, who would actually get it before Top Pops did? Yes, I do like uh, movie moments. Um, I have a few. There's, um, I don't like them all, but I do like uh, movie moments. I think there's some good movie moments that can be done. Uh, I think the Jaws and Orca would be a good movie moment where Jaws is up on the, the boat. I think that'd be a good one. Um, American Graffiti, I think, would be a good movie moment. Those cars uh, for the drag racing. Um, there's just there's tons of tons of good things that can be good movie moments. But yeah, I do like movie moments. I'm I'm wanting the uh, the two battle scenes with Ray and the Praetorian Guard and uh, Kylo and the Praetorian Guard. My favorite movie? Oh my lord! Favorite movie. That's a good question. Um, honestly, I don't know if I have a singular, but I really like the last Mad Max movie a lot because I like all the other Mad Max movies. Um, all right, man. See you later, brother. Um, so I just, I, I love the Mad Max stuff. Um, but yeah, favorite movie of like, 2018 or all time? Because I'm a movie junkie. I love movies. So yeah, I'm a. I don't know. That's that's a that's a. I still haven't seen Ant Man and Wasp yet. How sorry is that? <laughs> all time favorite movie of all time. Um, I will tell you the movie. I'm not gonna say it's my favorite of all time, but it's the movie that I will never forget when I saw it. Um, it was Full Metal Jacket, and I saw it the Saturday night before I had to go report to Marine Corps boot camp that Monday morning. So, yeah. And guess what? The boot camp scene in Full Metal Jacket. See these sparks? Um, yeah, it's pretty realistic. Pretty realistic. Lots of yelling. Um, but yeah, that that movie I will never forget because you know I reported to Paris Island, South Carolina, on that Monday. I went and saw that movie Saturday, and and it was I think it actually. It released in the theater where I was at. When was the release date on that? Let me look here. Let's look here. Yep, 1987. That's the year I went to the Marine Corps. Yup. That's a, yeah. <laughs> that was it. That's the movie that honestly I think will, uh, oh man, The Exorcist, The Exorcist is, whoo, yeah. <laughs> That's a page turning movie right there. <laughs> uh, I was in the Marine Corps from 1987 till 1991. Um, I actually got out on a medical, I blew my knees out in a training accident and, um, yeah, the Marine Corps is, uh, they have a pretty strict policy because a lot of people, if you guys want to know a little education about the Marine Corps, I'll tell you, I don't want to bore you, but if you do, then I'll tell you. But, uh, so with all the branches of the service, Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, Coast Guard, the Marine Corps is the only one, only branch that is uh, solely controlled by the President of the United States. Every other branch of the military cannot be deployed without congressional approvals. Uh, the Marines, actually, the President of the United, like Donald Trump right now could actually call up the Commandant of the Marine Corps and say, I need troops on ground here. And they would go. That's why the motto, one of the mottos in the Marine Corps is the first in. 
because we don't need anybody's permission other than the President of the United States. Uh, the, uh, typically, the Marine Corps stays uh, a very small number worldwide. So whenever you, uh, whenever Marines get injured or something like that and can't pass the physical fitness test, you know, you got to be replaced. So that's, that's the education of that. So. Yeah, David, David, got, yeah, I know who exactly who you're talking about. Yeah, see, seals. Ooh. Seals are scary. Them boys don't play. I, I got some good friends of mine that are, that are seals. Yeah. They don't play. They don't play. Well, guys, I guess that's it for this, this stream. So, uh, I failed. I failed on getting something, but I had success on hanging out with you guys. And to me, that's more important than a pop. So, uh, guys, make sure and, hey, get out and hunt something today. Like I said, I picked up earlier. I got a couple of things this morning before I came to work. Uh, I got some P.O. Box stuff that I picked up last night. And I think I have something to go with this one in one of those boxes. Um, I'm actually going to try to get um, part three of it, or, uh, mine and Kent and Ryan's Atlanta Comic Con video out today. Uh, so make sure you got the notification turned on, and that way you won't miss it. Um, I, yes. You gotta send me a postcard. Guys, I love postcards. Because they're so hard to find. You think finding a chase is hard? Go try to find a postcard. <laughs> I'm serious. Uh, but yeah, so I'm hoping to get that out. Um, the last video, and then I might do, I don't know, I think honestly I could do two more videos just on Atlanta Comic Con. But I'm on. I don't want to bore you guys too much with that, so I might just try to make it one more. That was just a lot of footage, a lot of footage, um, and a lot of good footage. Uh, but that one's coming out, hopefully today or tomorrow. And then, like I said, I got some peels. I got some stuff in my PO box I picked up last night, so I got some a uh, couple of unboxings to do. But man, guys, until next time, thank you so much for joining. I really hope you enjoyed this stream. It's as always, like, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know what you think. Support each other. And let me, let's just get out there. Whoops. Boom.